all right guys so i want to quickly show you guys two different types of weekly profile you are going to experience every time as a trader okay first of all i want you guys to take a look at this weekly candle right here i'm on weekly time frame on euro us dollar okay so this is the close of this week price action you guys can see how big this candle is okay it's like an expansion candle then this was last week candle this was last week price action now i want you guys to quickly take a look at both weeks you can see the difference between this week and last week okay this week there's an expansion there's big volume in the market why last week there was nothing and this is what i want to show you guys okay now if i go to daily time frame regarding last week price as shown this is where the market opened and then this is where the market closed so in the not share there was no specific movement in the market that week and also there were so many manipulation if i go to lower time frame you will see that there were so many manipulation the market will go bullish and all of a sudden they will reverse so many traders definitely go to take a loss that week just like me i took a loss last week but this is the information i want to bring to you guys you see as a trader you definitely going to experience these two kind of profile okay an expansion profile and a contraction profile now taking a loss is not a problem as a trader but how much are you losing you can see i took a loss last week in fact let me pull up one of my accounts right here so that you guys are gonna see all right so i'm only going to show you guys this small account this is not part of my trading portfolio i just nearly got this account because i want to help my mentorship student pass their evaluation account so i told everyone get an evaluation account let's pass it together so this account i think i traded it only twice this week but i can guarantee you guys that this account as of when i started it last week it was on a drawdown i think about two percent drawdown okay you can see the account has moved from drawdown from minus two percent to almost two percent in profit you see taking the loss is never a problem but never let that day you want to take a loss damage your account this is the problem that most profit traders face they are trying to force the market to move because definitely if the market does not want to move on a particular day there's nothing we retail traders can do to force this market to move so if you take a loss in the market never let it damage your account because this is the problem i see most retail traders face the day that the market does not want to move they want to force the movement on the market like days like this the market does not have a specific direction you can see it was going up in the morning and of a sudden started coming down and then it started going up and then of a sudden started coming down and then again fired up you see days like this many traders go to hit stop loss but let it just be within your risk management plan because this is why most people violate daily trading limit